everybody, welcome back. It's day 27. I'm sorry, I'm just having a little bit of coffee there. Um, and we are still working on our altered file folder. <laughs> Feels like it's never going to end, doesn't it? Um, I'm just going to show you. This is what we worked on yesterday, and I just came back and added some eyelash trim under there. Took a couple of the tickets from the kit. This is a touch of spring. Um, Artie Mays. I will leave the link below to this kit. I have elements from other um, kits that are from my stash, but the whole project has been based on Artie Mays kit. Um, it's it's just beautiful. So that's where we've left off. Um, we added this little flip up, and so I'm just going to carry on because you know you've got the concept now. Um, now what I have done is I added this, this is not part of that kit, this is from my stash, and I wanted a little pocket under this CD case, um, but you can certainly use one of the um, journal cards, I just thought that kind of made it stand out a little bit more. This is one of the postcards, so I've tucked that in there, and then this is one of the... Um, tiny journal cards and I kept them together and created and then they look at these little labels that come with it so I just made a dinky little notebook and I just ran that through the sewing machine so I've got a stitch that's holding that together and um, so that's another tiny notebook that's going to be part of this um, because I want to complete this guys. I've got other stuff I want to um, <coughs> get started on with this series. So um, so over here what I've done is just kind of cut out what I know I want to use within it or what I think I'm going to because that's I'm not too sh you know I always just try to gather things and then I can eliminate them if I need to but um, I know I'm going to put that there or at least I think I am but um, we're not going to work on that right now. Right now, I have decided that this needs <coughs> some more flips. So what I've done is I just took a piece of um, one of the background pages and I've cut, I've printed it out on cardstock. I measured that at one and a half inch, scored it at three quarters, and then I ran it through. Um, you know, a decorative punch. You don't have to do that. It, it doesn't have to have that, but I just like little extra details like that. And what we're going to do today is I decided that we might as well just make this even more interactive. So we're going to position these. And I want to see the top of the tab. If I didn't, I would do what I did on the previous one, score that, and just make it a flip over. But I don't want that because I think that adds a a lot on that spine. So I've just created a little hinge here. Um, and let's just go ahead and ink that because that will show when it's um, well that side won't but this side will show. So let me just um, show you guys what I'm talking about here. Got some paper clips handy. Okay. <sighs> Let's see if our glue is going to cooperate. <laughs> um, the first thing I think is best to do is, yeah, let me get this glued in. Oh my goodness. Okay. It's all kicking off again. Okay, I hope I'm doing this right. I really, really do. Sometimes um, I think I know what I'm doing and then I find out, oops. <laughs> I don't want to cover that stitch because I think that's a nice touch within. Okay. The reason I did that is because I've got to make sure that these are going to be positioned where I want them to be. 
So let's start with this one. I want to get that up there. If I do that, I think I have to move this up slightly. Okay, yeah, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to try to leave those in, in the spot that they're at, because otherwise it's not going to be adhered enough to that. I just don't want that to go over the top of that file folder. Okay, I think that's okay there. Let me see. Let me go ahead and get this bottom one. And um, da, da 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 da. Let me see what have I got here. Let me just stick that under there because I got a horrible feeling that that glue is going to creep out. So that way we've got we've got those aligned where we want, and actually that makes it stand out. You know, you can see better what I'm trying to do. I want to make sure I've got these all straight. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, so there we go. I'm gonna leave that for just a second. I have one of those adhesive erasers but it's in my storage unit <laughs> everything's in the storage unit okay so that way you can see this is going to flip over and you've got all this hmm you know what i just it's just occurred to me i'm going to come through and snip that you don't have to but see you'd have each of those flipping at the same time and I want them to all be a separate element. That way, okay, so let's just see how we like this. So you're here, you want to do a little journaling there, but those are there. Then you can flip that. Oh, I love it. Love, love, love that, how that's come out. And I'll come back later and just um, ink those a bit. I don't, I want to leave it because I, I want to make sure there's lots of little writing spaces in this, so I'm totally happy with that. Um, let's get... Um, some of the ephemera. That I'm going to do on the front. Yeah, I don't know. I definitely want to put that down here, though. So let me ink this up. Maybe a little. I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll make this a pocket as well because I might as well make it um, <clears throat> function as a pocket. Okay, guys, let me just cut out a few things. Well, Um, da, 
da, da, da. I want something over here, but I don't know if I want to. Okay, this is one of the pockets, so I'm going to use this, but what I'm going to do is have to cut it down so that it'll fit this project. And um, I think, guys, I'm going to um, probably just finish off the front. And then call this complete is what I think because um, the rest of it will just be add, coming back and filling in, and I, I do feel like this is starting to just drag on, and people are going to lose interest. Because um, the, the thing is, you, you've got the basis of how to add these now, um, and I think, let's see, okay, so, oh, isn't that going to be pretty? So what I'm going to do, I mean, in all fairness, it could... I'm just going to leave it. I like that. I'm going to run this through, through the machine and I'll be back to adhere it. Be back. Okay guys, I have been to the machine and stitched around that. So I'm just going to um, glue this down now so we've got a little pocket there. Let me hold that for just a minute till that gets a good there we go. Okay, so let's see. While that's sticking, um, I've went ahead and made this tag that's gonna go in there, but I'm not gonna put it in yet because um I'm afraid that glue will stick to it, so very quickly, I know I want to do a little something here. Um, I got a tiny tag. This is paper tray ink. I don't re uh, tiny tags. That's the name of it. It's a um, tag and um, stamp set. And sometimes paper tray ink will discontinue things for a while and then they bring them back. So I don't know if it's available or not. I've owned this for years and years and years. Um, but it is probably one of the best purchases I ever made. Because I've used this set over and over and over. Um, Okay, so I want to just go along the edges real lightly with that. Whoops, sorry, I'm out of camera again. Okay, let me set that there. I know I want to get a little eyelet.
Okay, I need a little bit of thread. natural one again. Okay, here we go. I just felt like that little tag just needed some little something, and that should be fine now. So, give you guys a close up. Okay, guys, that's um, going to be it for today. And uh, the next one is going to be doing the cover, and then that's going to be the end of this project because I will carry on uh, finishing this out. But um, I feel like we've covered everything so that you can um, you can do this project on your own. So, um, like I said, one more um, episode in this just to do the cover, and then uh, we'll move on to something else. You guys have a great weekend, and I'll see you here soon.